Folks, welcome back to the Car Care Nut. It's Rick here, my sidekick Ivy, and there's Rigley. And today I'm doing a, I guess the first impressions. There you go, first impressions of this uh, hybrid ceramic uh, wax by Meguiar's. It uh, hasn't even hit the stores yet, and there's a big buzz on the internet about it and on YouTube. So figured I had it. I figured I'd just do a quick overview. Now I'm applying it differently than the directions say, and probably differently than most people are going to apply it uh, basically steps one through five here you wash your car with mcguire's car wash uh, you rinse the vehicle thoroughly of all soap and then you spray it down with the mcguire's hybrid ceramic wax and then step four starting with the roof you really use it basically you know, use a stream of water use a lot of water to get it off the paint and then step five dry the vehicle really well and then down there below that basically for your first application for your initial application it says to ignore step four so what i did is first off this stuff is very very thick i mean extremely thick it smells really well too it smells like blueberries but uh i mixed i mixed up a batch of it uh 10 to 1 10 ounces to one ounces to one ounce of product and what i've done is i've applied it to a my uh to a a sponge here and what I did is I sprayed a, a squirt on the, on the sponge and then I sprayed a squirt on the panel and then uh, I wiped it in wiped it in you know vertically and horizontally wiped it in <clears throat> once I wiped it in I, I came back behind that and I wiped it off with a microfiber now, for, now I did I did skip a step. Once I washed my car, I did wash the entire hood, and that's the only part of the car I've done so far. It's just the front upper part of my hood, or the upper part of my car on the front. Once I washed it, wiped it down with isopropyl alcohol. Did it twice to make sure I got all the other coatings and everything else I had on the car off. Followed it up with uh, a spritz of this on the sponge and a spritz on the panel, and then massage it into the panel. Wiped it off with a microfiber. Now what I did then is, once I did, did the entire panel, because I did it in sections, I didn't do just the entire roof, or, I'm sorry, just the entire hood, I did it in sections. So basically I broke this up in quarters. Um, I did the entire hood. And once I did that, came back and I sprayed some water. And this is just plain water. Sprayed water over the entire one section of the panel. And followed that up with the with the uh, ceramic wax here and just basically two spritz a spritz here and a spritz here and like I said even now this is mixed 10 to 1 this is very very thick even even mixed and of course I'm shaking it up before I use it but I'll demonstrate it real quick I'll uh, show you kind of what I did on my second application here is uh, I just missed this all over the entire panel Just like, you know, basically what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to mimic, you know, just once you get done washing your car, you know, your car's still wet. Okay, now once I've done that and I sprayed the other section on, or the other uh, stuff on here, it says one spritz, that's two spritz, I'll get two and a quarter spritz, there you go. So now what I've done is, uh, what I do is what I what I'm doing right now is I'll take one microfiber rag. Now I've kind of debated whether to just take a wet microfiber rag or towel, or to take a dry one. Now this one's damp now from doing the last application on the entire hood, so it's already wet. And it's already got some chemical on it. So either way, you know, this is how I'm applying it. This is not what I'm saying that you should do. If you buy it, this is what I'm saying. I'm doing it's just an awful lot of product, awful thick. This is what I'm getting at. It's awful thick for it not to be diluted, especially if it's designed to go over an entire car full, you know, basically drenched with water. So I'm just trying to get the, I'm trying to figure out the best way to apply it. I know what the directions say, but to me, the directions don't make any sense, especially with the initial application 
So this is kind of like the follow-up application. So now it's it's on there. Make sure I've got it worked into the hood scoop here. And there's some streaking. Now you gotta remember this is still damp. There's some streaking. I don't know if you can see it on the on the panel. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back, follow up with a dry microfiber. And buff it out. Buff it out. Buff it out. I know I'm not doing this great on camera, but I'm holding the camera and trying to do this at the same time, so I apologize. All right, so there we go. And this is inside, of course, with without natural lighting my LEDs so it's it's showing up as good on camera I think at this point as it is in person there's no streaks no uh, no issues I don't know how the water how the water beating is I got a bottle of water here I guess I'll just pour it on there see what happens That's just a bottle of water we had sitting around. So, yeah. all right, well, thanks for stopping by. I'm about to run out of time here on this phone. So, thanks for stopping by, and uh, we'll try to keep updated on this thing. Bye. <laughs> here, just for a, I guess, just for a follow up, real quick, on what's going on with this ceramic wax. I was running out of time a few minutes ago. I, um, just for a quick follow up, it's really, really slick. Um, but yeah, there's the but it's not as slick as the rest of my car and um now i usually use a combination of different things but the last thing i used on my car was a uh was my high gloss mixture that i mixed up and it's got some uh it's got some uh, eco uh, rinseless wash in it and some reload in there so but I know, basically, let's check this out. It's, uh, it's basically selling point. It's the basic selling point is the fact that it's a ceramic wax, not the fact that it's a high gloss or really super slick or anything. So you can see, if you look at this bottle, now I've only used just a little bit. And of course, I put that in there. But just wanted to add that to the end of the video. The fact that uh, you can tell it's on there. You can feel it. You can feel it's real slick. It's not real, you know, catchy like, you know, just a regular clear coat when you wipe it off with uh, your isopropyl alcohol. But you can actually feel the product on there. But when you compare it to the other parts of my car, you know, of course, I'm touching it very lightly on a clean panel. So either way, I just wanted to add that real quick to the... Uh, to the end of the video, thanks for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe. Leave some comments on down below. I got two whole bottles of this stuff, so if you uh, if there's something you want me to give a, give a try with this uh, wax, I'll definitely give it a try and uh, see how it turns out. But thanks for watching.